All right, straight ahead, we get to a middleweight matchup between Uriah, Primetime Hall, and Robert Whitaker. Our tale of the tape for this much-anticipated middleweight encounter. Hall is six years his senior. He will have a six-inch reach advantage. Now for the official introductions, here's Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Mario Yanosaki. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out O2 Arena in London, England. This man is a kickboxer, holding a professional record of 20 wins, 4 losses. He stands 6 feet tall, weighing in at 185 pounds, fighting in Sydney, New South Wales, Australia, Robert Winnicott! And now to his opponent, fighting at the red corner. This man is a karate fighter. Only a professional record of 14 wins, 8 losses. He stands 6 feet tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Fighting out of New York, New York. You run up! Oh! All right, I gave instructions to you guys in the locker room. I want you guys to follow my orders at all times. Defend yourself at all times. Touch gloves. Good luck. This is a fight that we have been looking forward to for a long time and is about to take place right now. I'm very excited. Dateline London, England, good to have you with us as always as we get underway with live action from the O2 Arena. Paul gets hit with a kick. That one appeared to land flush. Oh, huge kick to the body. a big right hand early. <laughs> Blocks the strike. That one hurt. Hall gets caught with that punch. His chin is held up thus far. We gotta shore up the defense here though. Ooh, blocks the shot. Nice. Good exchange there. And a nice one-two with the right and the left. And he eats a right hand there. Well, his opponent found an opening there to the body. Nice hook shot there, but as he leans forward in trying to get into his own striking range, he's gonna pay the price there to the body. Gotta be careful. You don't wanna eat too many of those power hooks downstairs. Inside leg kick lands and immediately a mark on his opponent. Nice. Whitaker's lower jaw could not look much worse, Joe. Extremely swollen at this point in time. We'll keep an eye on it as this fight moves forward. Ooh. Tags him. Well, that's a pretty filthy combination there by Whitaker. Joey missed with that straight right attempt. High level MMA defense there, able to avoid the punch. Nice job by Robert Whitaker. He's going to a different look here, switching southpaw. Inside leg kick lands. Oh, he is hurt here. Oh, he's got it going tonight. Beautiful combination of strikes there by Hall. Oh, body kick attempt here. It's no good. How about that chin? Whitaker gets tattooed by a solid uppercut there. Can't oh, take too many more of those. Oh, with the right hand. All right, back to his feet. But, man, is he hurt. 
weren't looking at Joe. Whenever you see a fighter's legs stiffen up like that, that's not a good sign. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Ooh, nice slip there to avoid the punch by Hall. Round two next. All right, so there's the horn. The round is over. The bleeding on the nose is not. The cut there is only getting worse. The blood is starting to come down into the mouth, and that's when it can impact the breathing pattern, Joe. So significant damage done in that round. The cut on that nose most definitely getting worse at this point of the fight. Let's take a look at it from a different angle. Brittany Palmer doing her thing as usual. Oh. Round two here. Look for him to go on the attack early in this round to try to pick up where he left off in the last round. His opponent was dazed and in big trouble when that round ended. Whitaker gets caught by the inside leg. Oh, lands that punch. Excellent job of timing these combinations. Nice punch by Hall. Whitaker's hook shot gets blocked. The defense saw that one coming. Oh, and he caught the kick. Well, they've made all the right reads here tonight, and there's another one. Beautiful read on the leg strike as he catches it and then returns fire with a punch of his own. So they have got the timing down here at this point of the fight. He's doing a really good job of timing his shots and landing a good series of strikes here. Oh, and he tags him with the straight hand there. Beautifully done by Robert Whittick. Watch the shot here, Joe. Right on the button. Oh, look how quickly he gets that hook to the target. Lands another one there. He's landed several in the round. Really starting to find some consistency with that hook. Exactly. Whitaker's lower jaw now starting to show signs of swelling. Under three minutes now to go in round two. Effective punch there by Robert Whitaker. Oh, beautiful straight left hand. He blocks the shot. Well, informed speculation says he's going to try to set up another hook here. Whitaker gets caught with that punch. Don't be afraid to get that head off the center line. Well, he has landed some good shots tonight, Joe, but as yet, he has been unable to string together any solid combinations, and that has served to keep his opponent in this fight. So let's see if he can change up the tempo a little bit with his strikes and try to put together a combination that is more damaging to his opponent. Both fighters throwing heat now. Timely defense there, huge block for him. Oh, oh big left hand! He's got him hurt here. Well, a really good second round for him thus far after a somewhat lackluster first round. He has found the rhythm and found his striking range. Scary proposition. Oh! He's clearly hurt. And another one. He's in trouble. And there he swung with a haymaker. Clean jab. Blocks the shot. It appears that cut is getting worse. Oh, beautiful! He didn't miss with that uppercut! What a fight so far! Whoa, 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 whoa. All right, that's the end of the round, and you see the cut on the cheek. That thing is getting downright nasty. It is getting worse here by the minute. And you got to wonder, to what extent does that impact him moving forward here in this fight? You at least have to ask the question. Here's a devastating kick that does some serious damage. And let's take a closer look at that from a different angle. Heart going down. Breathe. Doing good, man. Doing good. Now listen to me. Let's give him some air. Let's give him some air. You're letting him control the center too much. 
Thank you very much, Carly Baker. Third round underway. That last round was an all-out brawl. If they continue like that in this round, someone's getting knocked out. Huge uppercut misses. Switching stances here. Nice job to get the foot off the canvas and to the target quickly. Beautiful inside leg kick by Whitaker. Punch coming, it's blocked. Wow. That one hurt. How about that chin? Can we show you the total strikes? Oh! 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 Back to the feet. Nasty combinations here. This fight is dangerously close to being stopped. Nice leg Looked like it did stop a little bit. Whitaker's in big trouble. Oh! Landed a gigantic kick for the knockout. Oh, absolutely one for the highlight reel right there. A tremendous kick to spell the end of the night for his opponent, and for him, I should say, but just caught him flush, full force, beautiful extension on the kick, and the fight was really over as soon as that one made contact. I'm not even sure he was conscious when he hit the canvas. Outstanding performance here tonight. Look at this. Bam! Nighty night. So there he is as the celebration continues. A huge knockout for him here tonight. That could hold up as one of the better knockouts of the year. We now go inside the octagon where Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mari Yamasaki is going to stop for this contest at 1 minute, 33 seconds of the third round. To play the winner by knockout, you won so there he is, the man of the moment. Certainly maximized the showcase here tonight, Joey. Gets a big win by way of the knockout. Certainly kept the judges out of it here tonight. Perhaps some bonus money is coming his way, but there will be no wiping the smile off of his face tonight. He will party deep into the night with his friends, his family. A huge knockout turned in by that man here tonight. And he has set himself up for a huge fight now, moving forward inside the octagon.